All right, guys, Gary Dean, DetailJuice.com. Behind me, you can see this Range Rover. We're about to start working on that thing is absolutely beautiful. So I have a couple of new things. Yep, that's coming back. It's part of my brand new mobile detailer situation. And something you've never seen before. That's what I'm going to be polishing the Range Rover with. So I'm super excited to get rolling. Um, I am going to... I'm going to go ahead and get the car prepped prior to polishing and then I'll show you guys what's going on. But I'm going to wash this thing with Ghost. And the cool thing about Ghost is that it doesn't leave anything behind. So you're not, you're not leaving any protective products that you have to worry about removing prior to polishing or prior to applying a protective product of some sort. Um, but this has none of that in it. It does have a very, very light and mild cleaning agent, so it does a great job cleaning, but it will not leave any kind of uh, residue behind, which is perfect for adding protection right after it and making that protection stick and last as long as it can. So I've got about two ounces of water in this bucket, or two, two gallons of water, and this is a four ounce bottle, so I only want to put about an ounce of that in there, so that's not quite an ounce. Yeah, it's about an ounce. So now we're going to wash the car with this. And then uh, I'm going to clay bar as well. And then after I've washed and clayed everything, because you can, you can hear Tony's actually doing the interior now, um, on these higher end correction and coating packages, we always offer a um, we usually do a, a free basic interior detail, so she'll just vacuum it out, wipe it down, and then we're out of there. But um, I'll show you. I've got my LED lights and everything, but let me get this thing prepped, and then I'll bring you back before I start polishing, and I'll show you um, more of more about the Ghost uh, rinse wash and uh, the brand new One Step polish. These products will be launched as well as this product i mentioned the other day slick af this is a very strong spray coating but it has extra gloss enhancers and extra slickness added for your enjoyment so uh, i've got a special mobile detailer package that i'm going to be offering march 1st 2024 and these are part of that so let me get this prepped and I'll bring you back when I've got something done and something to show you. All right, we, uh, no, I'm not. All right, so I've done, I've polished literally this section of the hood, this fender, this whole door, and half of the passenger door there. And my trusty light that I love so much. All right, so. Take a good gander at the lack of clarity and the swirl marks that are in there. The cool thing about this paint is that it's uh, black metallic and because of that the metallic will actually reflect the light so your eyes will see the metallic before you see these swirl marks. But if you know what you're looking for you're seeing all the nasty. Now I did a one step polish before I moved this light. I did a one step polish with my brand new one step. It is oil based <clears throat> instead of water based. Now I generally love water based polishes because they work faster. They have a shorter working cycle or open time and they correct and do their job much faster. The downfall if you're looking to work a polish longer is that if you overwork it, the water-based ones will dust. Well, I am not over water-based polishes by any means. In fact, this is the only oil-based polish that I have in my range, but this one-step polish was specifically developed to be able to polish in direct sunlight here in Florida. I get a lot of jobs where I can't be inside, so I have to be outside doing some polishing. And while I don't make it a habit to do full paint corrections in the sun, 
it would be great to have an option where if I needed to polish in the sun, I didn't have to worry about all the dust, premature drying, and I could get the correction I wanted and keep moving forward with the job where it will save me time and allow me to make more money outside. So with that said, I did a one step with the new one step and I used the orange buff and shine five inch pad on my DeWalt uh, cordless polisher there. Um, the polish is here. It's got a four ounce bottle here. I'm actually just testing how much product it takes me uh, to do this entire Range Rover. So uh, again, you see what it looks like before. Now, look at that clarity. <laughs> Clarity's awesome. Very little, if any, scratches left behind to even mention. Now, I've got the light there in between, the center light is in between where the tape was. It's actually right where the tape was. The one on the left, or one on, well, yeah, on the right here, over here, that's where I haven't polished. You see that massive scratch rolling right through it? And over here, you can see the clarity where I did polish. So, yucky poo poo ka, amazing. So, that's a new one step. I'm gonna keep rocking and rolling. I'll bring you back when I do a section of the hood where you can see a little bit better. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, here you go. I have not been able to show off a car in the sun in a while. Just got done coating this thing. It's awesome. So, I did not realize it had rainbow flakes in it, but it does. You can actually see all the colors popping out in the sun. The clarity is intense. Uh, so, quick rundown on what happened. What this guy got. Um, so, I did a one-step polish on everything. That's it. With my brand new oil-based one-step polish. I don't have the official name for it yet, but it will have a name by March 1st. But it is my oil-based one-step. Now let's quick rundown on why that's amazing. It was specifically designed for me to be able to use as a pro detailer in direct sunlight here in Florida in the summertime when none of that is super ideal. <laughs> so, it is oil-based. It has our proprietary and very ab amazing brand new abrasive situation. Um, it also is highly concentrated. A lot of these same polishes on the market, you're gonna use about three times the amount of polish you're gonna use all with this one step uh, with somebody else's one step. So it's incredibly concentrated. I literally brought a four ounce bottle of the polish with me, this guy right here. The uh, new one step has been worn down, but this bottle was full, actually it was full right to that line, and I used right at one ounce. It's a four ounce bottle. I used where my thumb is, and you can kind of see it, is where the uh, oh, polish is in the bottle, right there, where my thumbnail is. So I used about one ounce, right at one ounce of polish for this whole full-size Range Rover. So that's pretty amazing. Um, pricing, not 100% sure on that as of yet. But <laughs> one ounce of product, did the whole vehicle, and I did more, I got more work done in one step in about two hours of polishing this thing than most people I know get in 
12 hours of polishing with other people's polishes. They're using a half a half a 16 ounce bottle. They're using eight ounces of polish compound. You're gonna use three or four ounces of polish. I mean, it's just ridiculous. So I have created a concentrated one step that works great in direct sunlight, cuts like the Dickens, finishes <laughs> just like you see it on an orange pad. I mean, look at this. It is absolutely amazing. I believe I have a winner. I've been working with this damn polish. I've been trying to get this done and released for about six years. It's very tough to create a better polish than, you know, the competitors have especially. But really, I, I generally deal with only competing with myself, trying to one-up myself. But now I believe that I have a full kit that's better than everything that's out there. And I would say that because my name's on the bottle, but beyond that, the cool part is I'm actually a pro detailer, as you see. So this thing was washed with a brand new product. Well, it's a product you some of you may remember from about six years ago. It's a rinseless wash product called Ghost. It is highly lubricating and it definitely cleans well, but it doesn't leave anything behind when you are washing with it. If you're going to polish or directly protect, that's when I would say use the Ghost. So that'll be available March 1st, 2024. Um, then after that, I clay barred with my Japanese clay bar. Um, I then wiped it down with the Amplify Prep Solution. I then polished with my brand new One Step. Uh, three section passes also. You do not have to work, 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 work this polish like other companies' polishes. You are going to do th three passes for a section pass. That's it. Not up to ten passes. There's no reason for that. You see, I got all this work done in three passes per section pass to do the whole vehicle. So then after that, I wiped everything down with Amplify again. Then, and if you don't know what Amplify is, it's in the uh, specialty products category on the website. It is a prep solution that will literally add about add up to 30% more longevity to your protective products. So got an Amplify wipe down, and then I put on, I have a very strong coating that I am going to release this this year as well um, it is a elite master coat pro variant uh, it is roughly four times the thickness of elite master coat pro fast five so fast five was designed to work very fast give you really good protection gloss and all of that stuff but the biggest benefit to fast five is when you use it with the dr jekyll and mr hyde system which is if you want paint correction but you want to preserve as much clear coat as possible um, that's what that system is amazing for and it happens really fast compared to other polishing situations but those polishes are water-based and voc free whereas this one is oil based so i cleaned the wheels coated the wheel well tony she's over there uh, she cleaned and coated the wheels. Uh, I dressed the tires with Dress to Impress, diluted 50-50. I sprayed it on a microfiber applicator and wiped it on. Um, Tony also did a very basic interior, nothing fancy on this thing. And then uh, that's it. Uh, we coated all the paint, all the trim, all the glass, the wheels, and I think that's it. I took the plate off. I'm going to put the plate back on right now. But there's no doubt this thing looks amazing. I could not get to the wheel barrels. Generally, I would at least get them clean, but you see that. There's no getting to those barrels unless you're pulling the wheels off. And yeah, it wasn't in the budget on this one. So, all right. Well, that's it. If you got questions for me, 813-846-4406. It's a 2024 Range Rover. This is the autobiography. <clears throat> fancy but that metallic though
All right, guys, thank you so much for watching these videos and listening to me babble. If you want something detailed, let me know. This Range Rover is complete. And um, I got the neighbor over there. I don't know if you can see him up there. He's uh, waiting for me to finish my video so he can come over and talk about it. Um, but anyway, it's all done. Check out DetailJuice.com for all your product needs. Check out DetailJuice.com on March 1st for all the brand new products that are being released this year um, that I just explained to you about and a few more that you haven't heard about. Uh, and if you need me, let me know. Again, check out DetailJuice.com and Gary Dean's Detail Juice Nation is a group on Facebook where we talk about only my products, my processes, what I got going on. It's a great place to be. If you want to learn more about detailing, be a part of a community that cares. So have a great day, guys. Thank you so much for watching.